If you're like me, you've probably been shooting dots throughout the summer, really tuning your bow and tuning yourself. But before deer season and even throughout deer season, I like to focus on that kill zone. I'm gonna change targets. I'm going from a yellow jacket to the Morel Transformer so I can really focus on that kill zone. And what I really like about the Transformer is I can simply change the target or where I stand to practice, you know, broadside, quartering away, and really refine my aiming point. Technique of how to shoot the bow is one thing. Having that aiming point for a hunting situation is another technique you need to put in your tool bag. When I'm hunting deer, I'm always focused on that bottom third and kind of behind the shoulder. So let's switch from dots to that and see what happens. Woo, I love that. So when I think about a kill zone, you know, you gotta drop down about six inches, give or take, depending on the size of deer, to get below the spine. But if you get a high lung shot, they're liable to run quite a ways and a lot of the blood is gonna pool inside the body. You won't get much sign to trail with. Midway, it's okay, but we know from filming for over a decade now, deer often drop as they hear the arrow coming to them. So I'm focused on the bottom third behind the shoulder. The heart actually lays like this. This be a heart shot. You're gonna have a lot of sign. It's gonna drain out quickly and there's gonna be a lot of sign to recover this deer in a short distance. Bottom third, right behind the shoulder. There's no dot right here. So that's why I like to change from shooting dots throughout the summer. That's great for really refining your sight pin and your technique to get to a situation where you don't have a dot and you can focus on that bottom third.